Hi. Tonight, I'm going to tell you a story about my son, Albie. When he was about nine or ten, we went to Hawaii. We went snorkeling in Hanama Bay. Show of hands, have you ever seen a tropical fish tank? Of course you have. Picture yourself inside of one and you'll get a little glimpse of what snorkeling is like. Contest chair, fellow Toastmasters and guests. For Albie and me, the experience was life-changing. We discovered that you can transform your world simply by turning your head. At the time of our trip, I'd only been Albie's mom for a couple of years. I adopted him out of foster care when he was six. He was adorable. He had these big stick out ears and a cowlick that made his hair flip straight up in the front. Okay, he was a little funny looking, but he was charming. He could walk up to anyone and in 30 seconds, they would want to take him home. It went a little like this. I'm Albie. Hi, 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 nice shirt. Hello, hello, nice to see you. What's your name? Mark, do you like ketchup on your hamburgers? Me too. I know why they call them that. Because you eat them with your hands. You all want to take me home now, don't you? What he was doing was sizing people up and disarming them so they couldn't hurt him. It was a survival skill. You see, before I met Albie, he had suffered some horrific abuse and he was a deeply wounded soul. He saw threat everywhere. So he developed a persona, a charming, adorable little boy. And he wore it like a mask to protect himself. Sort of like this snorkel mask protects my eyes from the salt water. It does a pretty good job of that. But the trade-off is that I can only see what's directly in front of me. Unless I turn my head, I'm going to miss what's over here. And over here. Albie was often so busy scanning his surroundings for safety that he missed a lot of the good stuff that was going on all around him. You know, the stuff that makes life worth living. His world was ugly and dangerous. To tell you the truth, I was surprised he went in the water with us in Hawaii. Oceans hide all kinds of scary things, sharks and stinging jellyfish and seaweed. But he was fascinated by the flippers and he let me lead him down to the water. We had these little baggies of fish pellets to attract the fish and they worked, let me tell you. It was like fishy crack or something. Fish were coming from everywhere, other continents to get the stuff. They swirled around us in psychedelic splendor. I looked over to check on Albie. He was floating near me. I said, hey, Albie, what do you think of all the fish? I can't see. What do you mean you can't see? Is your mask fogged up? No, I see sand. Sand? Okay, yeah, but above the sand. Can't you see the fish? They're trying to get the food. I see sand. Somehow, in the midst of this spectacle, Albie had found the one spot devoid of life, and he was peering straight at the ugly bottom of the bay. How could I show him that there was more? I waved my hand under his mask to try to catch his attention, and then I moved it over to where most of the fish were. His gaze followed my hand, and he saw. He saw. 
His whole body wriggled with the exhilaration of finally seeing something beautiful. A thin cry erupted from the snorkel. Fish! Look at the fish! I see the fish! It echoed in the tube as if it had traveled a long distance from somewhere deep inside him. Maybe it had. Water that a moment ago had been lifeless and empty was now magically transformed into a world of color and shapes and motion simply because he turned his head. And he began to see that the world isn't always ugly and dangerous. It's easy for us to get caught up in that same kind of narrow negative thinking that Albie was doing. We focus on what's right in front of us, paying bills, North Korea, and that mysterious pain that started this morning. We can forget to turn toward life, art, and music, and love. Fellow Toastmasters, turn your heads. No, really, turn your heads. Look around you. These people, this community of Toastmasters, is one of the things that makes life worth living. Turn to each other and transform your world into something Beautiful. Contest check.